Hello again. I'm Teacher Oakley. Welcome to Verbling. Today, in this class, we will be having a conversation about pets and animals and how people interact with animals. And uh, we're going to talk about pets. And if you if you have a camera and you want to show me your pet. Turtle, fish, parakeet, dog, cat, and the class. You can bring your cat, pet to class today. Okay? Yay! All right. We're going to practice many things. We're going to practice description. We're going to describe our pets. Uh, not only what our pet looks like, but maybe our pet's personality. So we're going to get to describe with more abstract language. We're also going to use a little uh, opinion language. What's your opinion about pets? Which do you prefer, dogs or cats? Do you think it's right to keep pets? Do you think it's right to keep certain animals as pets? Uh, okay, uh, Juan, welcome back. Hi, Juan, again. Hi, again. Hi. Do you have any pets? Yeah, I have two dogs. Okay. Yeah. Tell me a, a little about your dogs. What kind of dogs? What do they look like? Uh, well, they are a little, um, I don't remember the, oh, uh, French poodles. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, uh, they are, but... Please, continue. Tell me, describe your dogs a little bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, well, they are very, um, uh, I don't know how to say when they are do they are they do things like um, travesuras in Spanish. Um, oh my God, I, I don't. I, I, <laughs> okay. Well, uh, uh, your your microphone is breaking up there. Maybe a lot of people are joining the hangout. Give it just a second here. Yeah. All right, uh, okay, maybe we'll talk about your poodles later. I'm going to say hi to some other people, ask them uh, about their pets. Maybe you can uh, listen and you'll pick up some vocabulary that will help you. Okay, my pleasure. Or, okay, no, it's my pleasure. Uh, hello, Salam. Hello. 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 hello? Ooh, I can, I can hear you, but it's very, very, very hello. soft. Ooh, hello? just barely hello? hear you. I can just barely, barely hear you, uh, Salam. I would like to talk to you, so if you can somehow adjust your microphone, maybe in the settings up above, uh, in the little gear, the little wheel, you can s adjust your microphone, or you may have to just adjust something on your computer. I can barely hear you. Okay, Stas, how are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Uh, so, Stas, tell me, do you have a pet? Yes. Really? Okay. Tell me about your pet. Uh, it's uh, a cat. Uh, it's uh, a gray color, gray. Mm-hmm. And uh, it is uh, very big. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, and uh, uh, they uh, he uh, eat uh, uh, sleeping uh, very uh, much sleeping and uh, very eat. Hello. What happened? Okay. Uh, I don't know what happened. I, I, suddenly, I, I can't hear. I can't hear your microphone, Stas. I, I don't know. Well, now, now I can. I heard that. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay. Now, if we, what we what we could hear from Stas. All right. He, he had. He was describing his cat. All right. Color. Uh, size, he's very big, 
What does the cat do? Oh, very good. When we're describing anything, the most clear way to explain something is to describe what does it do. Uh, I can say it's blue, it has buttons, it's made of plastic. I can talk about the material. But really, if I tell you what it does, I use it to write on paper. You're going to know what it is. It's obviously, it's a pen. It has buttons. It's plastic. Okay. Um, so he described his cat's activity, main activity, which is no activity. <laughs> Lying around the house. Very good. Okay. Uh, another interesting, now I, we can talk about color, size, what they do. All right. Obviously, we're talking about pets, so we can talk about the breed of dog or cat. An interesting way that we describe people uh, in English, we often talk about people, are you a cat person or a dog person? We sort of talk about people's personality. Uh, do you prefer cats or dogs? Maybe that preference shows something about the character or personality of that person. So, Stas, are you a? Do you think you're a cat person, or, or a dog person? Stas. Oh, sorry. Are you a cat person or a dog person? Cat. Cat person. Okay. Yes. Are you like your cat? Do you just lie around your house? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you don't have to answer that. All right, okay. Uh, okay, Adam. Adam's Adam. Good morning. Hi, how are you doing? I'm fine. How are you doing? I'm great. Thanks. Uh, do you have a? Uh, do you have any pets? Well, I, unfortunately, I don't. But I used uh, to have a husky. Used to have a a what? A do, um, a breed of dog called husky. Oh, husky. I got gotcha. you. Yeah. All right, I just did not hear you, that's all. Oh, Huskies. Oh, very good. Where do you live? I live in Egypt. You live in Egypt and you had a Husky. Yeah, it was. I, yeah, and it, it's, yeah, I, think I know. It's, it's Husky, not Alaska. For sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah, for sure, yeah. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Well, it, it was the torture to it. Yeah, I admit it. Okay. Uh, did it... Huskies, now, correct me if I'm wrong. I might be wrong here. I, I seem to remember that Huskies can have, like, two or three different color eyes. They can have blue, blue eyes. eyes yeah. Blue eyes. Yeah. I think a purebred has blue eyes. I'm not sure. Did, did yours have blue eyes? Yeah, my, my dog had a blue eyes, yeah. Uh, cool. Blue eyes. All right. And... Was uh, all right. You okay? Was your dog well trained? Did you was it an inside dog, an outside dog? Did you do anything, anything with your dog or? Yeah, actually, its best activity or its yeah. preferred hobby is to drag me around the streets. <laughs> <laughs> Great. All right. His hobby was to drag you around the streets. Very good. Yeah. So you, obviously, you let your dog exercise. It using was a big dog. You, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, using me as a weight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Very good. Cool. So, do you think you're a, a dog person or a cat person? I'm not sure. I prefer dogs. Okay. All right. Maybe we'll talk about that later. We'll, 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 I'll be asking some opinion questions. I'm going to go around the room and ask about your pets, get you to do a little description. Oh, I'll come back around the room. We'll, we'll do some opinion stuff. So yeah. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, thank uh, you. Thank you. Gary. Hello, Gary. How are you today? I'm fine, thanks. Okay. Where are you from, Gary? I'm from Mexico. From Mexico? All right. Yes. Gary, do you have any pets? Yeah, actually, I have one here. It's a ferret. A ferret? No kidding. Can we see it? Oh, excellent. Check it out, peeps. He's a rat. 
It's a rat. It's not a rat. It's a can of rat. <laughs> It looks like a big rat. <laughs> yeah, it's big. It's really big. Yeah, it is big. Is yeah, that wow. Yeah, it's a ferret. <laughs> I, have, I have two ferrets and two cool. ducks. Real and two dogs. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm very interested. Uh, ferrets are more and more popular in America, and uh, I've known people who had ferrets before. But I, I didn't really. I've never had a ferret. What's What's it like to have a ferret? Are Are they easy to take care of? Or they tell me very Tell me about easy it. To yeah. Care because they They are always sleeping. <laughs> just Just running in the night in my room, but uh -huh. in the day it's always sleeping. And they are very clean because they They always do their things in in a corner. <laughs> do their things in the corner. Okay, yeah. Gary. Gary's a very polite young man. Very good. All right. Uh, they do their things in the corner. We they do their business in the corner. That's uh, another way we say that politely. Politely in English. Okay. Can you guys, so can you write the name of that pet on the chat box? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. It's a ferret. Where are ferrets from originally? Do you know, Gary? I don't know. I'm yeah. Not... Yeah, they are for Europe. From Europe? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I did not know that actually. All right. Um. So are ferrets actually nocturnal then? Do you know yeah. nocturnal? Okay, hang on. I'm writing it. Nocturnal means they. Oh. Like a bat, yes. it's only at yeah. night. Night, mm -hmm. nocturnal, and uh, diurnal means uh, it does it does its business in the day. Yeah. <laughs> Humans are diurnal, pretty much. Uh, yeah, okay. Ferrets are nocturnal. An owl is nocturnal. Very good. Ooh, I'd love to talk to somebody with a pet owl. <laughs> so I, I actually I have to ask you, Gary. I'm I'm very interested. Are ferrets uh, are they very affectionate? Do they like to? They like to be yeah. petted, pet, pet a pet. Yes. Yes. They. Do you mean if they are lovely? Well, affectionate. Do Do they like to? Do they like? Um, do they like attention? Do they like to be touched? Do they like to be? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, held? they are very calm. So when I when I touch it. He he lick my cheek, like oh. a duck. Cute, very cute. Nice. nice. What what are their names? You have two, right? Yeah, I have one named uh, Luna. Luna. Oh, yeah, Moon. Exactly, and, Luna. Very good. And Jue, it's it's Moon in Chinese. Oh really? Jue. Oh, very cool. Why did you pick that name? Those are cool names. I, I like the moon. <laughs> okay, cool. I like that name. It's a good name for a ferret. All right, I, I'll talk to you later, Gary. I'm, I'm, I have tons more questions for you. I'm very interested. I have if, and, and, can be used to chase rats and hunting rats. Hunting rats? Oh okay. yeah, they hunt. Is that rats. true? Hunt yes. Rats. Really? They're carnivores. They're yeah. carnivores. Okay. Nice. I need one. Really? <laughs> what did you say? Send you one? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Send you one? <laughs> yeah, okay. Welcome to Verbling. Learn English and exchange your pets. Sure. Okay, we can do that. A little oh. Pokemon. All right. Uh, Iran, do you, do you have any pets? Is that with me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you have any pets? Yeah, I have a dog and five birds. A dog and five birds. Yeah, <laughs> really? It, it really? With one bird, but now I have five birds. <laughs> what kind of birds? It, it, I don't know. It's a really hard name in English, but in Spanish it's carasucia, like deer face. I have no idea. Is anybody, anybody that speaks Spanish, know what? What is a carasusa? 
Kara Sousa? What? Beauty face. Like, you have a DD face, something in your face. That's the name in Spanish. Look at this. Okay. Don't know what that is. Tiny bird is green. And uh, maybe Kara has yellow Susha. eyes. Uh, okay. He can talk, but just a little bit. He can talk? Really? Yeah. What can What can he say? He can only say maybe six to ten words. Ah, but also, you know what? My what? beard can sneak. What? My beard can sneak. Your beard? Like, achoo! Oh, sneeze! Ah, <laughs> sneeze! Is this sneeze? sneeze? Yeah, that's a, that's a word. Yeah, he can sneeze. Right. I, I am too. I am very allergic, and all the morning oh. when I get up, to, when I get up to going to work, after going to the bathroom, when I came out, I always sneeze. Uh. I when I said ah oh, ah, oh, they said shoo. <laughs> <laughs> <You can't breathe. laughs> That's very funny. Okay. They are, they are very smart, you know. They can open the cage and get out and get in whenever they want. Yeah, okay. That is very interesting. Birds are very smart. Actually, birds are one of very few animals that can pass the mirror test. Okay? The mirror test is, I don't know, it's not that scientific, but... It, some scientists talk about the mirror test. Are animals self-aware? If they see themselves in the mirror, do they attack it? Do they think it's another animal? Or do they start to play with it? Like, oh, like move their hands. Or Do they understand that that is, in fact, themselves? And birds, like parrots and parakeets, some birds that can learn language, uh, pass the mirror test. A bird will recognize that it's looking in a mirror. It's looking at itself. So actually birds are very smart. Smarter than most people think they are. But my dog is not smart. He, he's <laughs> not at all smart. He's a dog chow. He's one of the... What is the, the antonym of small? The antonym of small is large or, or huge. Could you write that in the chat box, please? Large? Okay. Smart. Someone that is not smart. Small? Okay. Smart. 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 Oh. Brilliant. Smart. Brilliant. Okay. He's stupid. Stupid. Yeah. My dog is stupid. Uh, okay. I got you. He's the most stupid dog in the world. It's a dog show. <laughs> you can go with that. What is, that is one of the most stupid kind of dogs that exist. <laughs> really? Okay. I recognize my own voice. I, I make the sound of a dog in his ear. I open his ear and said, woof, woof, and he's scared, looking everywhere. Where's another dog? You can't believe that. <laughs> so that's, that's very funny. Your bird is smarter than your dog. 100%. <laughs> that's very funny. Okay. Interesting. All right. I got more questions for you, too. Ayad? Ayad, are you there? Ayad? Okay. Ayad. Can you hear me? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Ayad, do you do you have any pets? No, actually. No? Uh, is there a reason? Do you not like pets? No, it's not like I don't like, but uh, I don't like this. I, I used to have uh, a dog. Ah, okay. And I was but uh, become not interested. Like I can't take care of him, so. Ah, okay. In your... I don't think very well. I'm very busy, so. Right. Okay. Very. Pets, All right. Yeah. Pets need to care and uh, yeah. to feed. Right. Okay. That's just a simple fact. Pets take your time and effort and you have to have the time and you have to have the environment to keep a pet. It's not really responsible to keep a pet if you don't have time or the money or the place to keep a pet. So Can yeah, I understand. Can you send me? Sorry, hi Skika. 
Hello. Oh. Hi. Welcome. Hi. Welcome. Oh, you, you you got in. Terrific. Skika, where are you from? I am from uh, Montreal, Canada. Caribbean. Uh, <laughs> Me <laughs> oui. Okay. Uh, really, you're from Montreal. Uh, I'm originally from Vermont, just across the border. <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, uh, that's where I grew up, just across the American border from Montreal, actually. Uh, okay. Uh, do you have any pets, Skika? No, no, I don't have. You do not? Have you ever had a pet when you were younger? Uh, my uh, my sister have a cat. Your sister has a cat? Yeah. Tell, tell me about your sister's cat. What does it look like? Uh, the cat meow meow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's the cat's activity. What does the cat do? The, the cat's very uh, noisy. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. He's vociferous. He's loquacious. He's noisy. He talks a lot. Is it a boy or a girl? It's another. Uh, yeah, a girl and the cat. Uh, Female cat. Very much, very much. Ah, okay. <laughs> I see. All right. Is it a big cat? Small cat? A uh, small blow. Brown, brown, brown. Uh, come on, brown. 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 Yeah. Small brown cat. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. This. Uh, you know what? There's a conversation going on in the. In the chat box. This is very interesting. Is this true? Uh, on. Are, are ferrets illegal in California? I'm reading. No, I have to Google that. Yeah. I don't really. Ferrets are illegal in California because the California Department of Fish and Game claims that if ferrets are let out into the wild, they will mate, multiply, become feral, and kill the other nothing wildlife. So, really? Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. They're, now they're gonna now they're gonna try to protect the United States border from ferrets in California. <laughs> No Mexican yeah. ferrets crossing the border under the <laughs> wire. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, okay. California gets carried away with everything, honestly. Those people are crazy. I've seen a lot of ferrets in the United States, so I find that I was very surprised to hear that. They are very popular. 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 Yeah, they are. They're very popular in the United States. I don't... I had no idea. Correct me if I'm wrong, but... There is a lot of love or, or things that are provided in California, no? We There's always a... used to hear that something is provided in California and the rest in the United States is not. Well, I, California has a lot of... <laughs> uh, California has a lot of... Uh, they pass a lot of laws in California that are not the same in other parts of the country. They're much more strict with pollution laws. They're they're actually this okay. For example, I happen to know I lived in California. I happen to know uh my girlfriend at the time was <laughs> was pulled over by a policeman and she had to pay she she went to court, she had to pay a five hundred dollar fine because she was eating pistachio nuts. The pistachio nuts, they're like green color. Very delicious. Yeah. She's eating pistachio nuts when she was driving. And she's throwing the shells out of the window. The shells, the outside of the nut. They're just... They're, yes, for that. They're just plants, you know. It's the shell of a nut. They're natural plants. They, they're just, they are wildlife. Yes. So I happen to know, I found out, because I went to court with her, there's only two things you can throw out or you can throw on the ground in California. Two things only. Pure water and chicken feathers. <laughs> what? Well, that's 
Chicken feathers? Pure water and chicken feathers. You cannot you can be arrested for throwing a banana peel on the ground. An, an orange seed. You can be arrested for it in California. Yeah. You can throw chicken feathers. chicken feathers? <laughs> <laughs> because actually I know why. Because the trucks that yeah, the trucks that take chickens, they they have wire cages. They they can't put the chickens in a box. Or the chickens would suffocate and die or they'd freak out. I, I don't know why. They have to be open. So the truck with chickens, the chickens are in the open air. And as they drive, of course, the wind blows chicken feathers into the air. So uh, as a result of that, because that's the only way to transport chickens, you can throw chicken feathers on the side of the road in California. <laughs> okay. Crazy, crazy stupid facts. Crazy but true. Uh, Absolutely. Yes. Can I, can I show you the other one? Yes, you can. I wish you would. Yeah. Okay. Here's the other one. Oh, white. Yeah. It's Alvin. Oh, albino? Yeah. Wow, that is totally cool, dude. What? Albino means all white, pink eyes. That is a ferret? Yes. Yeah, that's a ferret. Check it's it out. Ferret. That's cool. That's awesome, dude. Yeah. Very cool. Wow, I, it's probably expensive. Uh, a little, worth, <laughs> yes. It's got to be worth a lot of money. I mean, first of all, it's a ferret, and second, it's an albino. It's going to be quite rare. <laughs> yes. Wow, very cool. Uh, hi, Mermaid, again. Hi, sir. Hi. <laughs> you, you can call you can call me Oakley. You don't have to call me sir. Uh, Mermaid, do you Oakley. have any okay. do you have any pets? Oh uh, well, I have a little uh, turtle. A turtle. <laughs> Which was for a while. Yeah. Wait a minute, I can show you. Oh, well, cool. All good. I like this class. Cool. Wait, are we gonna see her turtle? No. Can you guys see me? A <laughs> ninja turtle? No, no not yet. We, no, I can't see. Okay. We we still see your normal Google avatar picture. Oh, I don't know why. I activated my camera, I guess. Really? Have a block from camera that you have to set up. I. Okay. But I've seen you before. I've seen you. you your cameras work before, right? It might be. A, it might just be the settings up in the toolbar. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know. Maybe either. that's the problem. Okay. <laughs> Any, anyway. So I got, I got uh, this little turtle, okay. and then uh, three chicks. Three, three. little chicks. Which I really love. <laughs> three you little know. what? You have three yes. chicks? chicks? Like yes, they're chicks. They're yeah, they're yeah. chicks. Baby chickens? Yes, exactly. Okay. You are my birds. Oh, okay, hang on. We're going to check out Alan's birds. Hang on. Oh, there we go. Okay. There they are. Yes, and uh, a bird. And a bird. Oh, wait, okay. Can you see my birds? Yeah. yeah. I, I, have have one. I have one. You have one, too? Oh, there we go. Yes, That's yes. pretty clear. Okay, yeah, all right. I think these are... What are these, parakeets? There are five of them. Five of them? Wow. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, mermaid. You have now. Wait a minute. You have a turtle. Yes. Let's talk about your yes, pet. I do. Describe your turtle to me a little bit. Well, <laughs> I'm not really 
sociable with it because it's small, but small. I like it. Yeah, okay. I like it. It's a little baby. What's its main activity? Do you, do you take it for a walk? <laughs> I would never take it for a walk. Never take it for a walk? No. It may, because it may take forever. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Yeah. No. Okay. Have you have you taught your have you taught your turtle any tricks? Can your turtle ride a bicycle? Or, no, it's or smoke, kind a, of stupid. Smoke, smoke a cigarette? Or some karate? No. <laughs> karate? Oh yeah. He doesn't. He doesn't. He's a turtle. <laughs> Ninja. Ninja turtle. Yeah, could be. Yeah. No. 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 Okay. <laughs> but he doesn't tend to eat much because he can. He. I don't know. He fasts a lot. What does a turtle eat anyway? I, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Tomatoes. Lettuce. You don't know. You're, you're a turtle. You, you better know. That's what I feed him. Like okay. some grass. All right. So you. Tomatoes and lettuce. All right. You feed your turtle salad. Okay. That's cool. salad. <laughs> salad with croutons, a little bread. Okay. Very good. How about your chicks? Now you said you oh have God. chicks. Really? They, yes. Like baby These chicken. Are the, yeah, yes, they are such a spoiled brat. Really, I really spoiled <laughs> brat. Yeah. Why? I don't know because they're getting crazier as they're getting old. They're growing. I mean, like they fly everywhere in the terrace. I don't, uh, I don't allow them downstairs. They're always. Uh, uh, stuck in the terrace in their oh. cage, but they are really crazy. I mean, they would, they would, if once they see food, they would like jump. Uh, I don't know. I just <laughs> so so interested. <laughs> okay, are you going to keep them when they grow into chickens or roosters? Actually, I don't think so because I would I would ask my brother to kidnap them or. To take them away before okay. someday they would have to slaughter them. And oh God, oh. <laughs> I, I can't do that. <laughs> She's going to eat it. Okay. Yeah. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> chickens delicious. Would you ever eat your chicken? Uh, uh, no, 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 no. No. You uh, just just last week. Uh, my family got uh, sheep and they slaughtered it in in the house here. Ah. And they found out after they after they did, they found out that it was pregnant. Oh! So, so I couldn't oh. eat it because oh. I said no way. There's no oh. way, no way I eat that. But I was I was kind of not insulting, but I was upset with my family. Right, I I understand. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but what can we do? <laughs> you know, you can, you can eat <laughs> rack of lamb. <laughs> yeah. Delicious. Okay. Uh, ten years, ten, ten years ago, I had a, a little uh, dog, doggy. Okay. But um, I, ha I uh, once we were invited to a family, uh, to a relative's house. And I took it there. It was, I think, it was a big party, and I put it upstairs just to be polite because I don't have to put it uh, inside the living room or somewhere mm -hmm. near the people. I took it now upstairs to the terrace, and my my aunt's husband took it, and he 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 went uh, he took it away and just uh, uh, put it there and came back home without it. So I just lost my Oops. dog in that thing. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I can't forget her. I mean I still think of it and uh, I'm willing to have another one. But not in my house not in my parents' house. Once right. I get married, I gonna have my pet dog. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so you, do you prefer dogs or cats? 
then? Dogs. Dogs. Why? Dogs. Tell me why. Because I think they are sociable. They are loyal to people. I mean, I don't know. They. I see a lot of value in dogs. That that uh, than cat. I I find cats a little bit annoying. <laughs> I don't know. They are lazy. <laughs> You, you see, you see, like a dog. Once, once he sees you, he would jump up on you, and like, they would, they would tell you, like, oh God, kiss me, kiss me, kiss me, hug me. Look like <laughs> cats. Cats are really lazy. They don't, they don't give, uh, they don't care about anybody. Like, whether you there or not, right. just feed them, and right. like. You die if you want. <laughs> ah, right. Okay, very good. Talking about personality of dogs and cats. Uh, very good uh, vocabulary. Sociable, loyal, annoying, lazy. Very good. I've heard, Mermaid, I, I, I don't know if you've ever heard this. I've heard it said that, uh, that people, people own dogs, but cats own people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's true. You are the cat equipment. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> They'll get to you when they get to you if they need to. Okay. All right. Uh Sebastian. Hi Sebastian. Hey. Hey, how are you? How are you doing, man? How you been? I'm good. Thank you. Good. So Sebastian, do you do you have any pets? Yes, I have. I have Two dogs, one cat, and two gerbils. Two dogs, two cats, and two, two gerbils. Wow. You're ready to build an ark. You're ready for the flood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> couple, exactly. A couple of giraffes, a couple lions, borrow a couple ferrets, you're good. All right. I can say a pet store, huh? <laughs> yeah, a pet store. Very good. What, what was the last one uh, animal? Ah. Yes. Gerbils. Do you know gerbils, Gary? No. No. Okay. Wait, I, I can show you. Oh, good. Oh, good. We're going to get to see more. I mean, they are sleeping now. No, I cannot show you. But I can oh, clear my screen. They're sleeping oh. now. Yeah, they're sleeping. Now, who was talking about rats earlier? Okay. <laughs> 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 All right, gerbils. Where are gerbils from? Sebastian, do you know? No, uh, no, I don't know. They're from the pet store. <laughs> no, I, I don't know where gerbils are from either. Gerbils and hamsters. What's the difference between gerbils and hamsters? Does anybody know? I don't know the answer to that. It's gerbils. Well, it's pretty obvious. They have a big tail. They're, they're similar really? to rats. But they are not rats, and they are seems like kangaroos because they jump. Like they jump very, oh. very high, right? Yes. Okay. Oh, okay. So okay. they are not just um, walking in four legs; they can jump in two legs. Okay, they get all right. Can they do any tricks? <laughs> yes, they can bite. They can bite. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. They can bite. They're watch gerbils. When we have a dog that we keep as a guard, we say it's a watch dog. Okay. So he has watch gerbils. <laughs> Killer watch gerbils. Okay. Uh, Sebastian, which. Okay. Okay. Uh, which are your favorite? You have dogs, cats, gerbils? Or do you like them all equally? Equally, equally, equally. pet. Okay. Yeah, but I have to say that because she's right next to me, my cat. She is. <laughs> yeah. She's, she's sleeping, but I'm sure that she's listening because she, like you say, she owns me. All right. Okay. She owns me. He has to be careful what he says in front of the cat. <laughs> yeah. All right. I can understand that. All right. We all love you, kitty, kitty, kitty. <laughs> Okay. Anyway, what do your do your gerbils have names, Sebastian? Yes. One, <laughs> one is called uh, Mr. Smith, and the other is Negrito. 
Mr. He's Smith. Black. Okay. Yeah. Black. And Mr. Smith. Yes. <laughs> is that okay? Does this have anything to do with uh, like Mr. Smith in um, what was the movie or series of movies? Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Oh, okay. Lots of Mr. Yeah. Okay. I was thinking of uh, oh, Mr. Play. There is a play in Mr. Smith. Yeah, there is. Mr. Smith goes to Washington. There's a lot of Mr. Smith, actually. Um, what's the movie? Actually is. What's the movie? You know, with uh, there's the bullets, and they're shooting at him, and you see slow motion. He he dies. Matrix. Matrix. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Wasn't the guy that's always trying to kill him? Wasn't his name Mr. Uh, Smith? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's what I was thinking of. <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, and the uh, only person I haven't talked to so far, Jakob. Are you there? Jakob. Yes. Hi. How are you? Hi, everyone. Uh, great. You? Uh, where are you from, Jakob? Turkey. Turkey. Okay. Very good. Welcome to the class. Jakob, do you have any pets? No. No. Did you ever when you were a child? I don't know. Uh, I agree that for uh, the first time, uh -huh. uh, I don't know what uh, to do. Oh, okay. Well, we're just talking, and our topic today is pets, like a dog or a cat or whatever. So we're just talking. We're, it's just a very simple conversation class. We've been at describing our pets. And I was asking if you ever had a pet. Did you have a pet when you were a child, for example? Uh, child meat? Yeah. Did you have a dog or a cat? Uh, I like uh, uh, was at Turkey. Uh, Turkey uh, popular uh, dog Sivas Kanga. Okay. What? Ser serious? What? Sivas Kanga. Just conga. I can Maybe you can write it. I I can't. Uh, Turkey spe oh. special book. Oh really? Oh I see. Okay. Cool. I don't know what that looks like. I wish I wish I could see one. Hmm. Interesting. Is it a big dog? A small dog? Can you describe it a little bit? Uh, very very big. Uh, very dark. big. There uh -huh. are uh, signs. Uh, two uh, metres. Two what? Two yes. Two meters? Yes. What? <laughs> that's huge. That's not. That's not big. That's that's huge. Oh my. Uh, oh my it gosh. Like, <laughs> it's uh, it like a uh, cheetah. Like a cheetah. Ah. Like thin. Thin legs and very tall, like that. Yes. Ah, yeah. how much does it weigh? How many kilo? Uh, as uh, fifteen. What? One more. Five fifty. Fifty. Yes. Fifty. Fifty kilo. Fifty kilos. Oh, that's big. That's a big dog. Now that could drag you down the street, <laughs> for sure. I want to see what it looks like. I'm very, I'm very interested. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, thanks, Jakob. Uh, you'd like to have a dog? What, can you cannot have a dog now? No. You can't. Because where you live, or you work too much, or something. Okay. 
Okay. Anyway. Thanks, Jacob. All right. And then goes. Okay. Oh, Nemo's here. Hi, Nemo. Hi. Okay. How are you today? How are you doing? I'm fine. Uh, we're talking about pets today, uh, and we've actually some of the students in class have showed us their pets. Nemo, do you have any pets? No. Okay. Or did you? How about when you were a child? Did you ever have any kind of pets? Yeah, I had a turtle. A turtle. Yeah. Okay. Her, uh, her name was Monica. Monica? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I am afraid to ask, but I'm going to anyway. Why did you name the turtle Monica? <laughs> don't, like, answer, don't answer. <laughs> don't answer. <laughs> don't answer. No. Uh, a little Monica in my life. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> I, you know, Monica Lewinsky. I, that's all I can think of. Okay, all right. Okay, that's very funny. All right, what happened to your turtle? Did he run away uh, from home? No, it died. Uh, you know, oh, um, tragic. Uh, accidentally, they <laughs> they threw it out uh, from the window. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Really? <laughs> Accidentally <laughs> thrown out the window? I hate it when that happens. My, my niece, my niece yeah, was, was holding her, her in, 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 uh, in her hand, uh -huh. and she, she dropped it uh, from the window. <laughs> Are you sure it was an accident? <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure about that. No, no, she, I have a question. He kept, he kept crying over okay. her after he died. After oh, she, she cried? She yeah. Okay. Yeah, who had, somebody had a question? Yes. Uh, yeah. That he died, uh, the right. turtle died because it was thrown uh, over a window, right? But in what, yeah. which floor? Was oh, good question. Thank you. Yeah. Have you gone to prison for throwing that up from the window? In <laughs> yeah. Okay, Nemo. Two questions. One: which floor? How high? Sixth floor. And second question: Did you did you have to go to prison for turtle side, like homicide? <laughs> No. No. No turtle we, side. No, we we <laughs> we, uh, we make we make uh, the perfect crime. Perfect crime. <laughs> oh. oh. Please remember, Nemo, that this class is being recorded. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. No. <laughs> If the CTIA comes looking for you, the Central Turtle Intelligence Agency, you know. So, but the, but yeah. they haven't done anything. My niece. They, they, my they will niece. take my niece. <laughs> take your niece. <laughs> Turning it into niece. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. Very interesting. Do you, okay. Uh, do you think it's important for people to have pets? Yes. Do you think it's good? Yeah. If you really? don't have pets before having kids. You okay. Know, so sometimes sometimes <laughs> it's better to have a pet uh, better than a, 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 a human friend. Okay. Well, especially if you're pro, you know, Nemo, I yeah. what if you had a child and you accidentally dropped it out the window? I mean, come on. Oh, that's, my, God. oh my God. That's no <laughs> really no <laughs> good. <laughs> that's, that's the reason. Yeah, yeah, that's his a... first with the pet. <laughs> yeah, that would, I mean, really. Uh, Nemo, what, I have to ask you one more question. You had a turtle as a pet. Have you ever yeah. eaten turtle? No, I, I didn't. You, you, you haven't? Okay, I, yeah. all right. It's delicious. You have, Elon? Mm -hmm. You've had... No, I haven't, I haven't. Neither. Turtle? Like turtle soup? It's good. I haven't, have the, the I haven't tried. You haven't tried. Okay, has anyone in the class tried 
it's turtle. Too, no? it, it's, it's an expensive plate. No? Yeah, it, it is expensive. You're, you're right. Yes. Oh, my uh, God. Has anyone... Okay, we're talking about pets. All right? Okay. Some people... Do people eat turtles? Yes, Adam. I've eaten turtle. Turtle soup? Yum. It's good. Uh, how about dog? Has anyone in the class eaten dog? No. Yes. Well, everything. Actually, I'm here in the Philippines, and sometimes people eat dog here. And in China and South Korea. Oh, my God. Yes, they do eat dog. Barbecue it. Make a big fire. <laughs> throw the dog in. <laughs> arr, arr, arr. <sighs> Talk about a hot dog. <laughs> uh, sorry. That's very tasteless. No, no one no one here has eaten dog? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. Poor dogs. I, I can't do it. I had dogs as pets all my life since I was a small child. I cannot eat dog. I have eaten almost everything else. Um, cannibalism? <laughs> Yeah, okay, Adam. What are your feelings on cannibalism? <laughs> yeah, but because it's kind of weird to people eat turtles and dogs now. It's kind yeah. of strange. <laughs> yes, it is. Do you, do you think it's just wrong? Or, you know, different cultures, it's, it's not, not that big a deal. You know, some cultures, you know, it's not okay to, to eat, for example, beef, cows. You know, in India, uh, it's it's not okay to eat cows, or many cultures, it's not okay to eat horse. Um, in yeah, fact, like in America. Yeah, like in America, and and recently, Europe, they're freaking out because they found horse meat in what was supposed to be the beef. So a lot yeah. of people. Yeah. Ah! Muslims they can't eat horses. What's that, Nima? Muslims also can't hear, uh, can't uh, eat uh, horses. Okay, Muslims. For us. There you go. Muslims also can't oh, eat they horses. Do, they do. Some they people. Do. Yeah. They do. They do. They do. They do. That. Some they do. do. Yes, they do. Uh, I've tried it. <laughs> You've tried it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's it's really it's really good for the for anemic people, people who have like oh, really? who suffer from like a I don't know yeah anemic people. It's really ah. good. Okay. Okay. High in iron, like that? Maybe. I don't know. I'm just guessing. I'm not a. Yeah, yeah. Yes, exactly. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Interesting. I I had a horse I've meat. I've tried it two times, I guess. Yeah, I've tried it before. I I don't know. I was not really impressed or not. Whatever. It just. Tastes like meat. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's okay. Some people, horses, okay, is another good example. Some people are very close to horses. They have horses as pets, yet other people eat them. Um, some people keep pigs as pets. Uh, the little Vietnamese pigs. Vietnamese pigs, yeah. Yeah, you've, have you seen those, Gary? Yeah. Okay. Here, I have a friend who, who has one. Oh really? Okay. Now, okay, I have I do not have a friend who has one. So Gary, maybe you know better than I do. Where does the Vietnamese pig do his business? Uh, the business? In the corner. Yeah, like uh, <laughs> your ferrets go into the corner, all right? Yeah. Where does a does a is a Vietnamese pig do they actually train it to go outside? Uh, yeah, they're trained, but, but it's very difficult, so uh, really? almost the time it's in anywhere, so you can, how do you say, well, we, um, okay, well, when uh, you train a dog or cat to go to the bathroom outside, you housebreak, we, we say housebreak. Uh, is uh, or we use the the adjective housebroken. Is your dog? Is your is your pig housebroken? <laughs> Meaning, do they know that they're supposed to go outside to go to the bathroom? Okay. Are the ferrets? The fer no, never mind. 
Okay, so yeah, all right. Uh, so have you guys, you, none of you have ever eaten, okay, a mermaid has eaten horse. Is it, no one has ever eaten dog here? No. Cat? Actually, in China, they eat cats, which I no. also find. I think Chinese, Chinese eat everything. Yeah. No offense. <laughs> no offense. Well, you know, it, honestly, you can't really be offended because it's true. They, they eat dog, they eat cat, they eat cockroaches. Okay? Ooh. Mm. Something I could never handle. Okay, speaking of that, interesting pets. Has anyone ever had an insect as a pet? Like a spider, for example? Or um, praying mantis? No? No. Nobody here? None of you guys? No? No. You never did that? You know praying mantis, the ones like this? <laughs> you know the little, the green insects? They, no, mantis. They're pretty big eyes and... Yeah, mantis. Yeah, yeah. We used to tie a little, you know, very tiny piece of thread around the mantis neck and tie it to the like end of the bed, and he's like, he's like my guard against mosquitoes or uh, other insects. No, what's an unusual pet? What's the most unusual pet that you've seen somebody has? Uh, anybody? Actually, we've only got like a minute left. Snakes. Snakes. All right. Mm -hmm. What kind of snakes? Like a python. Yeah. Boa. Boa constrictor. Yeah, actually in the United States that's actually pretty common to have a snake as a pet. My roommate in college had a tarantula as a pet. So I had a tarantula, big one. Do you know tarantula? Mm -hmm. Very big, hairy, nasty, ugly spider. Are they bite? <laughs> Uh, no, yes. No. Yes, they do but bite. They are not poison poisonous. Well, they, they are poisonous, but mild. But, well, different different species, different breeds of tarantula are different degrees of poisonous. But they, it won't kill you, but it can make you a little sick. Yeah. What do they eat? They eat other insects. Or even small mice, actually. He used to feed up baby mice. Freaky. Ah. Yeah, he, we would freak out all the girls in the dorm. We would, like, carry the tarantula on her head. Just knock on her. <laughs> hey, ladies, how you doing? Ah! It was fun. It was kind of fun. Okay, uh, anyway, um, thank you guys. I enjoyed the, today's discussion. I really enjoyed seeing you guys pets. That was especially cool. Uh, but it's time for me to go and uh, make room for the next fine verbaling teacher. So thanks a lot, guys. Nice nice to meet you guys that I just met. Nice to see you guys who I've seen many times before. All right. Take care.